Yo, what's up, Gear Nerds? It's your buddy Dustin from Blue Collar Gear Review. I uh, just want to kind of come to you real quick and show you a new pedal that I got. And before I even get into that, I want to thank my very good friend Justin Longshore. Um, he's a longtime friend and a uh, pretty, uh, pretty renowned musician in the metal community, if you uh, recognize that name. Um, but he and I have been friends for quite a long time. And this year for Christmas, he sent me a Plumes Earthquake Devices uh, Overdrive pedal. It's a wonderful pedal. Um, if you can tell offhand, if you're, if you're familiar with this company at all, uh, this is a Cherry Bomb Red limited edition paint scheme. And it's got a couple of different really cool modes just built into the overdrive. So it can go from the pedal itself can serve as a clean boost, a crunch pedal on its own, or a kind of what you would be more familiar with as a overdrive in front of a front uh, front of a high end high gain tube amp or something like that. So it features three modes: um, one, two, and three. Mode one is more of your crunch if you want to use it kind of as a drive pedal on your board. Mode two is kind of less filtering, less clipping, um, less diode interference, if you will, and it kind of gives you your best option for a clean boost. And then mode three is a bit more of a loose feel, but you can kind of tighten that gain and tighten that tone a little bit um, using it as you would a, a standard overdrive. So um, without further ado, let's dive in. We'll go through some sound samples, uh, go through modes one, two, and three. Again, mode one being more of a crunch kind of sound, mode two being a little bit less of a um, kind of a impact, if you will, to kind of boost that clean setting. Uh, you can always kind of dial that level in and out. You can always dirty it up using that gain knob a little bit. And then lastly, I'll switch over to a different guitar, um, more in the drop tune kind of range to get it um, similar to what you might hear uh, is that using it as a boost pedal. So without further ado, let's dive in. So real quick, before we dive into the sounds of the pedal, I'm um, just kind of showing you what you get in the box. Uh, again, I've already opened this one and been playing with it a little bit, so I kind of spoiled the, the unboxing. But you get your uh, get your user manual, um, the different kind of stuff and features of kind of how to set the pedal with some different samples. Um, the artwork on the box is just so stinking cool. It's a big old, like, crazy-looking octopus thing. Um, you get this cool little burlap kind of carrying bag. I don't know how much I would use that because like if I'm using a pedal board or something, um, that's one thing, but maybe if I'm carrying it individual to go hang out with somebody and show the pedal off and don't want to scratch it up, that's kind of cool. And then you have your, your of course, your Earthquake Devices sticker, again, featuring another uh, skull slash angry octopus. And then the pedal itself, you got your level knob, your gain knob, your tone, and then your, uh, your mode switch right in the middle of the pedal. So let's dive in. All 
All right, guys, uh, I hope that the tone uh, is articulating clearly. It's a very, very, very just brilliant pedal. It complements what you kind of pair it with. Um, you know, again, I'm using a solid state amp for this demo, uh, but just kind of hearing what it can do with solid state. And I, I've, I've loved to um, really dive in more, maybe even replace my overdrives on my board and run it for the, uh, the big, the big tube heads. Um, really nice pedal. It, it, it cleans up, it cleans a lot and it, it adds a bit more bite to the dirty if that's what you're going for. Um, you know, it's your, it's your level, your gain and your tone, pretty much standard uh, knobs for, um, you know, these types of pedals. But it really seems to have a large range of sweep, and I think the mode the mode switch really uh, kind of goes into that and helps kind of shape that tone even further. So, uh, I, you know, I wouldn't have had a chance to try the pedal uh, if it weren't for, for my buddy. So, Justin, again, thank you for that. And um, I'm now a I'm now a big fan of Earthquake Devices uh, pedals, and I'm interested in trying some more of them. So, again, if this video is helpful for you, as always, we encourage you to check the uh, pedals out, check out the gear. It might help you make a gear selection if you're on the fence about something. Uh, me personally, this Plumes Overdrive is really well built. Um, it's almost too pretty to put Velcro on it to stick it on a board. It's, a, it's such a just nice pedal. So, anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope this was helpful, and we'll see you on the next one.